Spring is almost on the horizon, meaning it won't be long before the cold and dreary wintry conditions make way for warmer weather. Because of this, you might be wondering when the best time is to get out into the garden and give your grass a much needed cut. Mowing the lawn in the depths of winter isn't always a good idea, because the cold weather makes the grass grow more slowly. And in order for your garden to thrive in spring and summer, cutting the grass at the right time is crucial. The Express reports most people often cut the grass from March until October before the chillier conditions begin to set in. This time window is ideal for grass blade growth, but the precise start date may differ due to things like late frosts and dramatic weather shifts. According to experts from the Woodland Trust, the perfect date to start cutting your grass is March 18th, and there are a few reasons for this. Grass often begins growing when soil temperatures peak above 6 C, but due to warmer weather year-round, some Brits continue to cut the grass even throughout the winter. The Met Office estimates the growing season has increased by at least one month compared to the period between 1960 to 1990. How to cut your lawn after winter The timing of your first cutting isn't the only thing to think about this spring, but also the way you do it. Firstly, it's important to keep your lawn mower on a high setting for that first cut after a harsh winter. Cutting too close may stress out the grass and cause shallow roots which could ruin the appearance of your lawn. You should aim to cut less than a third of the grass height for that first mow in spring, and you can remove more as the season goes on. It's also important to consider the time of day you cut the grass. Choosing to do it later on in the day is ideal, as this will mean any frost has melted and dew has dried up. A late afternoon mow is the perfect time to begin cutting, so aim for a mid to late March mow on a warm day. Sunny weather is also crucial as this means the grass should be totally dry when you go to cut it. This will help you make a clean cut and promote healthy roots whilst avoiding damage to the grass and soil. Join the Daily Records WhatsApp community here and get the latest news sent straight to your messages.